Hello, so welcome back to my channel. Today I will be starting off the August monthly haul. It is in fact like the 24th or the 25th of August, but with everything that happened, I haven't really bought anything for the boys this month until now. There's a couple of orders that I've got coming in, um, a surprise gift from someone and uh, something else as well so there'll be a couple of more clips in this video to show you but I'll show you what I got today and yesterday so I love giving my boys potted herbs so when we were in Aldi today I got some basil and some coriander I'm not sure how I'm going to give these to the boys since they don't have their cocoa quad dig box at the moment I was thinking about maybe sort of like zip tying them to the um, side of the cage but we'll figure something out for these two herbs I also got an ear of corn I'm going to wash it and give it to the boys as a enrichment item I won't let them eat the whole thing at once because there's only two little boys with this full ear of corn but it will be a fun enrichment opportunity for them and ears of corn are just very cute in my opinion you know, his, his Benny is um, intrigued and the last thing that we got from Aldi, which I used to put some of the shopping in, is this little, I think, seagrass basket. I'm not sure how I'm going to use it, but it would, <laughs> if I could cut a hole with it, in it without it fraying, would make a nice, like, hanging hide um, for the boys. And then I went to a local pet shop um, and I bought these two treats from this brand called Carney Love Into the Wild. I really like them for these boys because they're basically like a high protein treat for them. Um, and given that they're quite young, they sometimes need a little bit of extra protein to help them finish out a malt. Hold on. Um, but they're also really tasty and really good ingredients in them, so that's why I like them. So this one is mackerel with raspberries, and it's a little fish that looks like this they're very cute and they actually smell like pretty appetizing to me so that's you know that's that's nice um and then this one which is really interesting and cool is ostrich and blackberries um and this one looks like a little bone looks like this like a little bone um obviously they don't get a ton of these um but they are um healthier for them to have and I also like supporting companies that make good quality treats for any animals and whilst these aren't aimed at rats they're like a decent quality treat for dogs so that's what I've got so far hello so I've just gotten back from visiting my parents for a couple of days which is very nice I was supposed to go and visit them at the beginning of August and celebrate a couple of birthdays but that's when everything kicked off around here and I just couldn't obviously leave given the touch and go-ness of the situation that we had. Um, I will be making a video about that experience probably sometime this week actually because I want to get it off my chest a little bit and share it because it was quite a stressful emotional hard time and I hope to be able to share my experience and possibly help people um, who may come across that situation in the future. So before I ramble too much about that, I will just show you what I got. So I was in Asda with my grandparents and I was looking at like jars because I always like to buy a good jar and Periite before he died smashed one of my jars that I got, one of my treat jars. So I was on the hunt for another one and I just wanted one in this style and my nan wouldn't let me buy one because she had one. So I got this from my nan, this jar. I just put in here the treats that I showed you in the last clip, the dog treat ones. There's actually two different kinds. There's the raspberry and mackerel ones and the ostrich ones and some of the older ones that I got a couple of months ago. Then also what arrived when I was away that's our ostrich steaks cooking. I actually ordered two of these homemade treats from somebody on Ratwise, which is following one of the recipes in the Scuttling Gourmet um, book. 
dinner is sizzling, sizzling. We're very excited. And so I got two tubs of these. I've actually decanted one tub into that um, white jar there, but I wanted to show you what I got. Um, I also, on Facebook, just happened to see somebody giving away or slash selling a bunch of hammocks, and she gave me this one for free. She just sent it to me because it was a bit tattered. Um, I just love little perch hammocks, and the zebra print was very cute. And then I got an order from Bogger Buddies from Emmy's store and I was very excited and I, because she has TikTok for her shop, she does pack, pack, pack with me sort of things. She packed my order and when I saw that video I saw that she had put in a box a couple of items that I didn't actually buy um, just as a little um, gift to me and the boys because of the difficult month that we had and it was just very sweet and I just want to say thank you very much Emmy for doing that. I have said thank you to you in person but I just want to like appreciate that a lot. Um, so thank you very much. The first thing that I've actually already put on my keys is the hello I am a rat mum key ring that looks like this and it's even got like a little nibble bit because obviously when you're a rat owner everything is nibbled. Then I also got these little seesaw toys, there's like two corns and a carrot. Then I ordered um, this nut hanging toy, which is from Rat Accessories. And then this is an extra thing that she added in. She added in extra this other Rat Accessories toy, which is just another little chew toy. And I ordered also some little stickers. Now I can't remember which stickers I ordered, I know I ordered two but she sent me three i can't remember which one it is that she um gave me extra but i have the tell your rats i said hi sticker which i just really love it's just really cute then there's hello i am a rat mum sticker and also this better together sticker i really like this better together one um so thank you very much for the extra stuff you added in emmy and i'm really excited and these stickers feel really good quality, so I'm excited. I'm actually planning to re revamp the stickers on my laptop because they're all like old and peely now. They've been on there for about two years. So I got these stickers and my mum got me some from her holiday that she was on and I just ordered a couple from Redbubble as well. So I'm excited to do a little revamp on my laptop, which is why I got these. And yeah, that's everything I've got so far. There is still to come my rat's tail order. And also I ordered a sneaky little thing from Fairy Kind Creations that I'm very excited about. I just ordered that today, so it might be a bit later in September when that comes, but I haven't decided what I'm going to do for the kit cut-off point yet, just because obviously I don't want two videos in a row to be um, haul videos, but yeah. So that's everything that I've got right now to show you, and yeah, see you in the next clip. Okay. So, I'm feeling a little bit hot. Anywho, so I apologise for this video being two months worth of haul and there being not very much stuff in it. Basically what happened is life and everything and I just, I got a couple of things for the rats but I never just like got around to sharing them. So I'm hoping to just like finish this video off now so then I can start like the October haul fresh when it becomes october which is in a couple of days so anyway yeah this is september this is some of the little other things that i don't think i've shown you yet that i've gotten for the rats so yeah that's what this is so the first thing that i got that i'd like to show you you've probably seen it is this little log bed hide that is very similar to my bonding bag that i have showed you in the past from fairy kind of creations which sadly she's closed down the shop now to focus on other parts of her life which is really sad obviously it's a really good thing for her but it's really sad for me because her hammocks and beds are like amazing but this is the log bed hide that i've got it's due for a wash it doesn't smell very nice but it's just so pretty and such good quality that i really wanted to share it with you you've probably seen this in some pictures on my instagram i also had an, a rat's tail order that i think i mentioned to you but the delivery service really screwed it up but in there i got a couple of foraging toys that looked like this i got some that were like fish skin and i'll put some videos of the boys using them because they absolutely loved them 
and also one that had Cheerios and straws but obviously that's also used now. I'll show you those. I also got in there in that package a little present for my vet because after everything that we went through she was literally like a rock she was amazing and she really did um much more than like i could ever have asked her to do and i just want to say thank you and she is coming over to do a health check on these two boys just for peace of mind's sake i think because i want to get back into shows and you know i want to feel safe around other people and their rats and things like that so i just want to like make sure that they're all good there's no like actual concerns that i have with them but anyway i got her like a little charm bracelet thing um here's Aldwin. he's a very good boy i think i woke him up with my faffing um but the other thing that um the other couple of things that i bought are some different more kind of naturally type of treats so pumpkin seeds and pine nuts both of these i'm kind of using for trick training aldwin has, is really picked up on it well and is a super spinner aren't you you do very good spins um but yeah that is all that i have really to show you in this whole video i apologize for it being really bad but hopefully the October one won't be it. And yeah, thanks. See you in the next video. Goodbye.